welcome back to No Catchy Name. Uh, today is Vlogtober. I almost said Miss again. Vlogtober. It's October, not December. Day two. <laughs> it is Tuesday, October 2nd. Um, yeah. <laughs> you guys hear me talking? Uh, I'm in the kitchen right now. You guys are in the kitchen cabinet. Uh, I'm just putting up some clean dishes and I just loaded the dishwasher. I'm going to run it after Devin gets up because I don't know if he took a shower last night or not. I got laundry going in the background, so there'll be laundry clips and dishes clips, and I don't even know what kind of clips today. <laughs> I may go to get Pokeballs in a little bit. I don't have anywhere else to actually have to go today, which is uncommon. Usually I'm busy, like, every single day. <laughs> but we don't have anywhere to go today, do we? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> uh, I might stop by the post office or... Uh, yeah, post office and Pokeballs. That's about all I have to do today. I just thought I'd check in this morning. It's already... Jeez. Yeah. It's almost 10 o'clock. Um, I probably won't film early, early in the morning. Unless we're getting up to go somewhere. Just because it takes me a while to get fully dressed and all that. <laughs> so, um... I probably won't be filming until this time every day. Hopefully I'll be able to actually finish Vlogtober. Because the Vlogmas got interrupted by technical difficulties. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, so hopefully I can share with you guys all the October things we're going to be doing. Cut cups. You don't need no cups. <laughs> um, but, yeah, it's about time for me to wake up Devin and Jesse's wanting to play. He's pushing on me right now. So, I will see you guys in a later clip. Hey, guys, I just thought I'd check in again. Jesse's playing outside. Hey, Bubby. I'm sitting here on the computer on Facebook looking up trunk or treats. <laughs> And other Halloween themed we had um, events going on in our area and put everything on the calendar and then I can choose what things we do there's a local art place we got from rats. yeah there's rats are smoking. yeah there's an art place in the city next to us the larger city next to us that's like you know we go and paint on canvases like they give you pictures and you paint them I don't what are you doing it's the rug the rugs in the way you gotta move the rug Um, they're doing a bunch of different things, and I went ahead and wrote a bunch of them down that I thought I could take Jesse to, and then we'll pick a couple of them to do. One of them is, um, well, one's a date night for couples, <laughs> and it's only $55, and you get, uh, to paint two canvases, which I thought was pretty cool. And then there's a paint a pumpkin thing, there's a garland workshop. What'd you do? I did it, I did it, I did it! All right. He locked it for. And there's a make a witch hat one. And they got a couple other ones coming up. And then I'm finding all the local trunk or treats and writing them down so I can try to get ones on different days. I've already found one, two, three, four, five of them. Three of them are on Halloween night. But I do want to take the kids actually real trick or treating too, not just trunk or treating. Last year, uh, by the time we got done trunk or treating, we only got to actually trick or treat for like 30 minutes before it was too late and people were starting to close up their houses. So, um, I'm thinking about, because most of these trunk-or-treats are in the town next to us, I think we may just trick-or-treat in that other town instead of coming all the way back to ours to trick-or-treat, which is what we did last year. We lost 20 minutes driving from there to here. So, yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty serious about trick-or-treating and trunk-or-treating. Okay, so look how messy the house is. Oh, what are you doing? I said go to bed and lock the door. Get off the couch. Okay, I'll make sure he doesn't kill himself. Oh gosh, it's burning up in here. I had the door open so that he could play outside. I'm about to cook some potatoes. I just, I cooked a chicken earlier and I roasted it. Oh, uh, hurry up. I'm burning up. <laughs> like I said, I had the door open so I turned the air off so that the house wouldn't just be running. And now it is hot. <laughs> But yeah, I'm about to cook some uh, little gold potatoes. These are mine and Devin's favorite, and Jesse really likes them too. Um, to go with the chicken, I roasted a chicken, and tonight for dinner, we'll eat the breasts, and then tomorrow, out of the rest of it, I'll shred it, or I'll take it off the bone and shred it and all that. I'll make some chicken and dumplings with the rest of it. Get this bag open. Yeah. Today's been pretty uneventful. Haven't done much. I, f 
filmed a little earlier. Where is there? This. <laughs> You're in my cabinet where all my spices are and I needed my olive oil. <laughs> but, um, I filmed a No Catch Your Name episode. I still gotta edit it. And I cleaned a little, did laundry. I meant to film a little bit more, but I've been just really bull today. I'm trying to get stuff done without being super interrupted by Jesse. So this will probably be a clip from, say it's Tuesday, so I'll probably film today and tomorrow. And then film Thursday by itself, because I imagine I'll be doing a lot on Thursday. Uh-uh! Okay, the potatoes are in the oven, and Jesse is asleep. I have to hold the other word angle for a second. I gotta get my cord, because I'm gonna sit down and edit while he's napping and the potatoes are cooking. He got into some trouble while I was filming, <laughs> and he didn't get mad at me, so he started throwing a fit, so that, that meant that it was time to go take a nap. <laughs> so I took him in the bedroom with the light turned off, and like two seconds later, he was asleep. So Now I have officially snuck out of the room. I'm going to sit here and edit a video and cook potatoes. Hey guys, it's later in the day. Um, it's 3, almost 3.30. I'm sitting here right now taking chicken off of a bone from where I roasted chicken yesterday. Uh, I meant to do it yesterday and I forgot, so now it's cold and harder to get off. <laughs> but, um, and I also have to wait. I forgot to thaw out some chicken um, drippings I had in the freezer that I'm going to use to make stock for the chicken and dumplings. Uh, I forgot to thaw them out, so I got them sitting in water behind me and am um, ripping chicken off the bone. <laughs> so I thought I'd hop on here and talk to you for a little bit and try to get this ready. So yeah, tomorrow we got to go do all of our weekly running. I got to go grocery shopping and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'm going to take my mom with me because she helps a lot with Jesse when Devin can't go. And he can't go because of working so much this week. He needs to sleep longer. So I'm going to get up in the morning and go up to my mom's house and pick her up. And then we're going to go do all the shopping and stuff that we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and get Jesse a winter outfit, like a snowsuit. We wanted to get him one last year, but we waited too long. And um, we didn't have enough time to buy him one locally. So they put them out at our Walmart here last week. So I'm going to go ahead and buy him one this week um, to have on hand for if it does snow. It hardly ever snows here, but it does still get really cold. And if it were to snow, and I'm sure we would take him out and let him play. I'm looking in the wrong spot. <laughs> Camera's over there. I was looking in the wrong spot. <laughs> but um, so we're going to get him a snowsuit. We got him a couple hoodies the other day at the thrift store. They had yellow tags or half or a dollar. And we found him two hoodies that were yellow tagged and a little raincoat that was yellow tagged. So he's got some little light jackets now for when it's cool. And then he'll have a bigger poofy jacket for when it's cold after tomorrow. And a raincoat. I want to get him some galoshes too. I'll have to order them. None of the stores around us carry them uh, all the time. Even the shoe stores don't really have them in there unless it's like spring. So I'm going to order him a little pair of yellow galoshes to go with his coat. And I want to get me a pair that matches his, a yellow pair. Just because I thought it would be cute and I'm that kind of mom that wants to match my kid. For the cuteness. And this chicken smells good. Yeah, we just... Um, Jesse's playing and I just finished watching another episode of the 90s on Netflix. I watched the 60s, the 70s, the 80s, and now I'm working on the 90s. I didn't know that it had come out yet. Um, I'm not really on Netflix a lot. I used to always watch either YouTube or Hulu, but um, I've been trying to watch some shows that's on Netflix. Some things that people have suggested to me. So I was watching that. I just got to the presidential one, I think. It's about um, Clinton. Uh, what's his name? Bill Clinton. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what it's all about because I didn't finish watching it. I just watched like 10 minutes of it. 
and then remembered I forgot to shred the chicken and I forgot to thaw out that other stuff. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just chit chatting right now. This is today's Wednesday. I can't remember if I said that. Today's October 3rd, I think. Um, I think I'm going to put Tuesday on the front of this one just because we didn't do much yesterday and so far we've not done much today. <laughs> Uh, been a pretty lazy day. I mean, Jesse's just been chilling. I was crocheting. I just finished a little blanket. One that I've been working on a corner to corner one for like all year. <laughs> I finally finished it and I put a little border around it. The only thing I got to do now is weave in all the ends and then it'll be 100% done. Ugh. I hate shredding chicken. But I like messing with cooked chicken way more than raw chicken. When I was pregnant with Jesse, that was about the only food aversion I ever had. There was two of them. One was chicken, which is weird because it's like my favorite meat uh, that I eat at home, you know. Not like, because my favorite meat would be probably steaks, but you know, I don't eat steaks every day. But um, I couldn't stand anything with chicken in it. Like, I had to get Devin to pick stuff out of my food and all that that was, had chicken in it. Like, if I, I wanted soup, I would get him to pick the chicken out of it and then I'd eat the soup. But, um, and the other thing was Ruffles chips that were, um, what are they? Something in cheddar. Sour, not sour cream and cheddar, but it's like some kind of chives and cheddar or something like that. And those used to be my favorite chips. But, um, I could not eat them when I was pregnant because, I don't know, they just smelled horrible to me. It made me want to, bleh. And then even now, after, since I've had Jesse, I haven't been able to eat them. I do like chicken again, I just can't eat those chips. <laughs> Which is really weird, because they were my favorite chips. Right now, mine and Jesse's favorite chips are probably Funyuns. <laughs> we snack on them a lot. And, uh, he loves them. He calls them Daddy's Chips, because the first time he ever had them, Devin had bought some and was eating them. So he wanted some of Daddy's Chips, and so now he just calls them Daddy's Chips. <laughs> but it's pretty cute. So I've almost got this all shredded. I got one more drumstick to shred if I can get the skin off of it. And, um, and then I'll check on the stuff in the sink and we'll go from there. Hey guys, uh, it is Wednesday evening. Jesse just went down for a nap about 20 minutes ago. I'm sitting here trying to get caught up on some Vlogtober videos. I'm so behind. Uh, I'm probably got like 40 videos on my watch later. <laughs> So, it's going to take me a while to get caught up. But, um, I'm sitting here working on my list of stuff to get tomorrow. I'm about to go through the kitchen to see what all we need grocery-wise. And, uh, doing laundry. I took a shower. I don't know if I had to take a shower earlier. I can't remember. <laughs> but, um, I'm sitting here. I'm going to wait, let him sleep for a little while. And then if he sleeps too long, I'll wake him up. But, yeah, so tomorrow's going to be a busy day. I don't know how much I'll get to film. I'll try to film something at least and then I think Friday I'm gonna take Jesse back to the train depot because they do those story times every Friday morning so I thought I might start taking him every week or so you know whenever we can and it's not rainy and stuff so I'm gonna sit here and watch some more videos right now I'm watching uh, can you see it I can't remember her channel name Mama Mama or something like that let me look yeah, Mama Mama. <laughs> I really like her videos. Um, so I'm going to sit here and watch her get caught up on her Vlogtober and then find someone else, go to the next person on my list and get caught up. And yeah. And for all the people out there who do podcasts and are watching this, I do watch y'all's videos. It's just I normally 99% of the time forget to comment <laughs> because I'm doing it like this. I'll sit here with it on the laptop watching it while doing stuff or I'll watch it on TV and I can't comment on TV. And sometimes I try to remember to go back after, you know, like later, and comment, but most of the time I forget. I'm really bad at that. <laughs> but I do watch everybody's videos. Or I try to. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to hop off here and get this done before Jesse wakes up. Actually, another clip. I wanted to show you. I was crocheting earlier, and I finished one of the baby blankets. Corner to corner blankets I've been working on. I'm trying to get it laid out. I just did a simple, um... Oh, it's the dryer open. I saw that light. I didn't know what it was. <laughs> uh, shell stitch border. But here it is on the couch. I got it draped over. And then the border is just shell stitches. Just 
an easy border but it's completely done I've woven the ends and everything all I gotta do now is wash it and put it up I like to wash it even before I'm gifting it just because um, it got dark <laughs> just because I like to feel how it's gonna feel when I do gift it to someone and um, then I'll put it up and wait for someone to have a baby <laughs> I love the colors of this yarn it's the I love this yarn Prince um, turquoise sky it reminds me of the 90s it just looks very 90s but yeah, I gotta get some clothes and put them in the dryer and then I'm gonna go back to do my list.